hi guys welcome back to my channel simply tanika dion i am your host dion all right now okay i'm gonna say it i'm going to say it as you can see by the title today i am going to be doing a battle of the magnetic lashes okay i have three sets of magnetic lashes here and i'm just going to tell you about each one and am i yelling i feel like i'm yelling i'm sorry if i'm yelling i don't know why i'm yelling okay if i'm yelling i'm sorry okay but yeah so i'm going to go through each one and tell you um, about the lash and what i paid and so forth okay as well as do a demonstration i'm trying to think i don't know if i will be doing a demonstration for all three because they're pretty much the same you just put the lighter on and stick it on but you know i may so whatever we'll we'll see once the video goes on okay so if you'd like to see the videos today then please keep on watching okay so the first set i'm going to be talking about or the first brand that's what i should have said the first brand that i'm going to be talking about is the kiss magnetic eyeliner okay and it looks like this um this is what the box looks like okay and these right here are the lashes very very pretty they're very nice i think anyone could wear this length it's not too long not um too short and it looks really cute and i think it'll look cute with a number of different eye looks okay and um yes yeah, so now i have these one on already because this eye look that i have on or this actual whole look that i have on that video should be up by the time this one is so you would have seen me put these on in that video if you did not i will uh link that above and uh, probably not above i'll put a card in there so that you can see uh the video with me applying these okay and these were applied in my um what was it the drugstore face full of new uh, makeup products uh video so yeah you'll see me putting those on in that video if i can remember though i may put a video insert a video in this vi um in this video showing me using this it just depends you know because sometimes when i edit my video sometimes i just skip through <laughs> so you know just being real and I, I forget to do things but okay <laughs> so anyway about these lashes right here these i got from ulta they were $16.99 and it came with these pair of lashes as well as the magnetic um liner okay now they do have five magnets in them and yeah so that pretty much you just apply this liner which i love because i like the liners that are wet i really do like you put it on it's a wet liner now with this one what you have to do because they all say different things now for this one when you're applying the lashes um uh, well firstly also let me just tell you like i said 16.99 and then i just bought an extra pair uh which was a little bit more dramatic and these were 8.99 so that's very very affordable 16.99 where you get one pair of lashes and you get the magnetic liner then i bought an extra pair for 18.18 for 8.99 okay that is super super okay oh, that is a awesome price so anyway so the liner you just apply the liner draw the line on as close to the lash line as possible now with these liners you can also make it dramatic if you want if you want to make the line thicker and then um wing it out cat eye it whatever you want to do you can also use that to use this to do that but when you're applying the lashes you just want to put it on as close to the lash line as possible um i mean stick the lashes on closest possible to the lash line so you draw the line and then it tells you that you need to wait until this liner is completely dry before you um put the magnetic lashes on now it doesn't say on here the time frame like it doesn't say wait a minute or whatever it just says until it is uh dry it says till the formula is dry once it's dry then you apply the uh, magnetic lashes which is what i did which probably i don't know I don't know I let it uh, sit maybe for maybe a minute a minute and a half I'm not sure because I put this liner on and then I did this so I put the liner on both since it said you had to let it dry so I just went ahead and put the liner on both eyes and I just let it sit for a little while danced in between a little bit and doing some stuff and then just let it dry and then I applied the uh, magnetic lash with the tool of course um, 
with my tool of choice which is generally this one right here looks like this um so yeah and then also because they are magnetic uh because they are magnetic um if you get it too close to where the magnets are it will stick to this <laughs> so you know when you want to apply you want to try to hold it uh where the hairs are you know what i'm saying like try to hold it here not like up here where the magnets are you want to i hold it right here and then stick it on like that now if you don't have long nails or even if you do have long nails and you feel comfortable just putting it on with your fingers that's perfect that's absolutely fine i just don't ever use my fingers uh, to put them on i have before but i don't know i just like the ease of using this okay so yeah once it's dry you put the magnetic lash on and look they're perfect can you see look beautiful beautiful for that little bit of price beautiful beautiful okay and now we're gonna get into um, the glamnetic which is I believe probably the most popular one out there right now um, uh, yeah is this glamnetic now okay so these are the come on Oh, that might be it. These are the Glamnetic ones, and it comes with the glue as well. It, well, it came with the glue in the bundle that I bought. The bundle that I bought um, at Christmas time was two pair of lashes and the glue, and that was $80. $80, you guys. $80, because one pair of their lashes are $30, and then you buy the glue for $37, you guys. Yeah. Egg expensive okay now i was going to get me um a couple other pair but like i said they are 30 dollars um uh, um pop so you know that's very expensive okay but i don't make the price you know what i'm saying it is very expensive so anywho now with these um oh let me just show you guys now i did a no i didn't do a video with me putting it on but i have worn these in videos before these are the same ones it's uh Oh, I was going to say the same ones I have on. These are the Kiss ones, the drugstore ones. See, there I go. But anyway, these are the ones uh, that are magnetic. Like both of these pairs that I have because it was in a bundle, they're the same uh, lashes. These are lush and they're the exact same. Um, so yeah, I got two pairs of those. And these also have five magnets in them. Um, so with this one, it tells you... Let me see because I can't even remember. Now with this one, it tells you to... Um, uh put the liner on with this is also a wet liner as well this one is the wet one and you have to let it dry so you put this one on and you need to let this the liner dry for at least 80 percent this one says let it get com the kiss says let it get completely dry and then apply the magnetic lashes the glamnetic says to let it get 80 percent dry and then apply the magnetic lashes uh what we're going to go ahead and do is i'm going to go ahead and do a little demonstration using the um, glamnetic ones, okay? If my battery dies before I finish this, guys, I just wanted you to see. Pretty, huh? Ready. So yeah, and this is the Glamnetic ones. And then the last one is uh, fairly new to me. Well, they're all new to me. But anyway, I was on um, Instagram and this popped up and I decided to look them up and just take a look and see what they were all about. Now these one is the Moxie uh, Magnetic Lashes. Is that it? Oh, yeah, Moxie Lash. And I did get the Dramatic Kit because y'all know your girl is just dramatic so yeah now this one um, comes with three pair of magnetic lashes the liner and an applicator so this is a very pretty packaging and this is what this looks like this is what comes in the box so yeah nice I'm glad that it comes with a tool you see so yeah okay and it also comes with the Moxie Lash Magnetic Eyeliner Remover Cotton Swabs. Isn't that cool? It comes it's 30 in a pack. And so this is what you clean because it also tells you how to clean them. Um, so, yeah. This, you know, they just come with the cotton swabs. This is cool. And, you know, 
tells you how to clean them. I'm not going to do that right now, of course. But yeah, um, if you get them, just know that you're getting some uh, cleaning swabs as well. Okay. So now let me just tell you now about these. Now the Moxie Lash are the most expensive ones. Um, now I wasn't looking for the most expensive ones. It just so happened when I looked them up, that's how much they cost. So these um, typically run $125. $125 for the three pack. Shoot. <laughs> for the three pack of uh, lashes and you get the tool and you get the glue. $125. That's even more than the Glamnetic. Okay. But you do get a tool. I guess that's how they justify. I don't know. <laughs> and three pairs of lashes. But anyway, so $125. But your girl did not pay that. I actually only paid $69, which was less than what I paid for two pairs of lashes and the liner for Glamnetic. Now, I paid $69 because um, I was a first-time buyer as well as I bought it during a sale. I can't remember how much the sale was off, and then I signed up for, I think, um, to be on the text list or something. You know, they send you a text or whatever every so long. Well, I don't know what it was, but anyway, I had an additional discount and I paid $69 for it. So I thought that was not bad at all from $125 to $69. Yes, please. Okay. Now, look at me. I'm messing everything up. It's falling out. But anywho, this box is really cute. Okay. So now with these um, Moxie lashes, now these, they tell you on the back because each one of them tell you um, on the back, on the back, and uh, on the back of how to do it. Now these ones, they tell you to um, uh, apply the liner and let it get dry for three minutes. Three whole minutes. That is a long time, y'all. That take that's as long as glue. But, you know, you got to do what it says. It says for three minutes and then you apply the magnetic lash and it should be all good. And like I said, I did get the dramatic kit and yeah so there is all the information about all three that i decided to get and to do the battle with today okay so now uh, firstly what i'm going to do is i'm going to go ahead and take off the drugstore ones and we're going to go ahead and apply the moxie uh ones because i've never worn them before okay all right guys so now, here is the tool for the Moxie Lash. It's pretty much the same as the one that I used. Um, really, really cute, but it has a little comb on there. Isn't that like the cutest? That's so cute. I mean, I would never probably use the comb, but I'm just saying it's cute and nice to have there. But anyway, so here is the glue. All right, and let's go ahead. I'm going to go ahead and apply, even though, you know, like I said, I did, I or I, um, I had the liner and everything on from the kiss. You can see, you know, that's pretty dry. I can go ahead and go right over this with this. And that's what I'm going to do. So let's go right ahead and yeah. I don't know if you're going to be, can you see the wand? All right. So let's go right ahead and apply this liner. Since it has to be three minutes, you got to let it dry for three minutes. I'm going to go ahead and do it and close to the last line as possible so i'm pretty much just going to go over where it was the first time this glue is more like tacky already like as soon as you take it out it's kind of it's not uh as liquid as the others that i've tried But, you know, all right, so that's maybe I should bring you guys up <laughs> so you can see. I think you were too far away. All right, so that's one. I'm going to put the other one on too because of the fact that it takes three minutes. See, this is going to be hard because I'm trying to. I feel like this glue. 
may not last as long as the other. I don't know, I feel like not a lot comes out and that, you know, it's pretty. And for $125, guys, I don't know. Looks like you might need, need to replace this more than normal. Because on some of them, they tell you to even uh, put two or three coats on. But I'm not doing that because. I'm just doing this as a video here. Just see how it does and how they look. That's all. Okay. I'm going to assume that it's been about three minutes. I didn't put a timer on. But I'm going to use these, uh, the ones in the middle here. Um, this is, again, the dramatic lash. So they're all supposed to be. But I'm going to take the ones in the middle and apply those and I can't remember if I told you guys that these have five mattocks all three of the uh, ones that I'm trying today each set have five magnets on them Moxie also has a version that has ten magnets but those cost even more so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and put the first one on This one is a little strong though. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, shooky, sucky. Oh, that. Oh, these are gorgeous. Okay. I'll play with them after I get the other one on. I mean, try to see more because, you know, I don't want it to do not work. So I'm going to do it in three minutes as I'm supposed to. Let's do the other one. Put the other ones on. Oops. It turned on me. Hold on. What? What? Oh my. Oh! Mm. You see how easy that was? Easy. And also, let me tell you guys, these, um, are not metal which makes it even better because these are like the ones you usually get are metal so it kind of it sticks to the magnet um it don't if you put it on use this the right way it won't but you know you may make an error or whatever and get it too close but these are not metal so you can hold these as close to the lash line or put them on any oh my god all right guys so yeah that is it i showed you three different brands of magnetic lashes and then the demonstration and magnetic lashes are definitely definitely here to stay they are here to stay they really are stepping up the game because you guys know because i've been saying for many many videos i am a glue girl i love glue i don't have any issues with glue i like wearing it lashes with glue because they last all day and i don't you know i don't find that i have any issues with my own lashes by wearing glue none of that so i like glue but but now <laughs> that i have tried magnetic lashes i think that glue may be a thing of the past and that is no cap guys Woo! Yes. Now, I think that um, the Moxie lashes for me are the way to go. Um, I mean, I like each and every one. I like the Kiss ones. I like the Glamnetic and I like the Moxie. But the reason why I'm saying um, because I have to choose a winner of the battle and I'm saying Moxie. Yes, they do cost the most, which... I thought by the end of this, I was going to be going with Kiss for sure uh, when I decided to do the video because they were cheaper. <laughs> but, you guys, Moxie Lashes. Okay, this glue, which I definitely underestimated. <sighs> Man, this glue has hold like glue. I said this glue has hold like glue. This liner has hold like glue, guys. Look at that. What? What? Oh my gosh. What? But anyway, um, yeah, it may be a little different uh, to apply because it's like, 
I don't know. I'm not going to waste it because like I said, it looks like you might have to buy glue a lot with this brand. I don't know. But um, yeah, I, I like it. I mean, it was a little bit more tacky from the start. Like when you take it out, I feel like it's already a little tacky, which is always good. Uh, it's always good to have glue that's already started the process for you but anyway yeah I, I i like it that's all i can say i put the glue on gosh why do i keep saying glue i put the liner on and i let it wait the three minutes i applied the lash and as soon as you get this like i said this is not plastic theirs is not plastic so as soon as you get the lash and put it up here you can already start to feel it a little bit it is ready to go to work for you oh my gosh they are strong they are beautiful and i'm loving it 100 percent 100 percent now the 125 dollars price tag is outrageous so if i ever buy them again because you know i got three and you know they they're gonna last for a while because i don't wear lashes every single day i only wear them when i um wear makeup or go out sometimes when i'm trying to be a little frisky or whatever but anyway so yeah i i you know they're gonna last me a long time but so i think i'm gonna have them a very long time but you know if i do uh buy some i will definitely make sure it's during a sale time um and get like a if you can get an additional um coupon code do that too but you know to pay 125 dollars, i don't think i would ever do that it would always have to be doing some sort of sale you know what i'm saying that's just me so but yeah would i purchase these again 100 yes 100 yes all right now the glamletic glamletic gosh i can't talk sometimes i'm so excited but anyway the glamnetic ones yes and yes they are great as well um i like them as well they apply super easy also you put the liner on with this and you wait a lot of time and yeah they go on good too i mean they're good as well i just think that um thirty dollars for one pair of lashes is extreme like the the 125 you get other stuff to try to make you feel a little bit better about paying 125 um but just to sit and pay but you know but you know a lot of mink lashes cost about 30 dollars from a good good company anyway so maybe that's not too expensive for some people but um you know i don't know but it's I, if I get um, these again, which, you know, I'm pretty sure I will buy another style or whatever from uh, Glamnetic as well. Uh, but it's always it's going to be in a bundle as well. I'm not going to pay $30. I'm going to have to get two or three pairs of lashes and a glue because I, I, I'm just not going to buy these separate. Uh, it will always have to be in a bundle deal because I'm just that's just too much to pay for it separately. So always will be a bundle deal with that. But yes, definitely would and will be wearing these numerous times as well because I really like these as well. And then to come to the drugstore, um, the Kiss. Now, Kiss was really, really good for dr uh, drugstore, really good. Um, Cause you know, I know that these are expensive. They are really expensive and I know that and I'm not trying to push nobody to go out there and spend this much money on some lashes, you know, especially if you're not comfortable with them or what have you. Um, but these are a great, great, great alternative to spending this kind of money. Because you saw I had them on in the beginning. I had this look on. And these lashes look super pretty with it as well. It wasn't as as dramatic or as bold. Like when I put these lashes on, it took this makeup look to a whole nother level. You understand? Whole nother level. That was from Mad TV. I can't remember who said that. Keenan, Keenan, Keenan. What was his name? Keegan Michael key yeah that's him but anyway <laughs> but anyway so um yeah so yeah these are this is a great alternative i'll definitely try these one day uh when i'm um uh doing another look or what have you but yeah i would i'll wear these again as well um because i was really really happy with them now did they feel as strong as uh the glamnetic and the moxie no but they do not feel like they're going to fall off though that's not what i'm saying they don't feel they they have longevity to them but um you can tell like when i went to take them off it's like they were going to fall off i mean i'm not saying that they would have fell off when i was out but when you um go to take them off it's like this like they were whew, it's about time you know what i mean like they were just about to fall right off uh fall right off on their own when i pulled them you know what i'm saying but 
they still are a great alternative y'all they you know you can always apply more glue uh, why do i keep saying because i'm a glue girl that's why but if you uh you can always apply more liner if you want to um with those but yeah so i am very very happy with all three all three but again me if I had a choice right now and they told me I can only pick one and choose one from now on, I am going to definitely go with the Moxie. I'm in love. In love with the Moxie for real. Again, thank you so much, guys. I really appreciate each and every one of you. And have a good night.